Right, next please. Rain, pouring down, harmless enough. But in quantity and helped by the surging tides of a great river, it can produce expensive devastation, even death. This is the River Thames, and to prevent this sort of flooding, or worse, a massive flood barrier costing 40 million pounds is planned for Woolwich Reach. Work is already underway. The barrier will be completed in 1979. The Thames is still a busy river. Work on the site of the dam has to be planned with care so that nothing hinders the flow of shipping. One of the team of divers comes back from the job in an underwater lift. It certainly beats swimming home from work. At the end of the shift, a thorough safety check and into the decompression chamber. Completed, the barrier will consist of ten large gates, six above and four below water level. They will be supported by these piers and will be raised or lowered to control the water. The concrete sills here will be sunk into position in the river bed and will firmly anchor the floodgates. The whole operation sounds simple, and it is. In the event of a tidal surge, each gate will be closed in 15 minutes. Full closure of the barrier will take 30 minutes. The gate is now in a flood defence position, ready for what the weather and Old Father Thames can throw at it. Four main navigation spans, each 61 metres wide and two narrower ones, will allow ships through. But there's a lot to do and time is scarce. London's ancient river usually behaves, but with England's erratic weather, there's always the possibility of flood disaster on a grand scale. London is being prepared. Royal Ascot and out come the colours. 